A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. The disciples said to Jesus, Now you are talking plainly and not in any figure of speech. Now we realize that you know everything and that you do not need to have anyone question you. Because of this, we believe that you came from God. Jesus answered them, Do you believe now? Behold, the hour is coming and has arrived when each of you will be scattered to his own home and you will leave me alone. But I am not alone because the Father is with me. I have told you this so that you might have peace in me. In the world, you will have trouble, but take courage. I have conquered the world. In today's Gospel reading, Jesus gives encouragement to His disciples. He knows that His disciples will leave Him behind in times of suffering. He tells them that they need not worry because the Father is with Him. With this knowledge of what is about to happen then, Jesus' main preoccupation is to ensure that His disciples will have peace with Him. In John's Gospel, Jesus not only depicted as somebody who is in control of the situation, but also as one who always thinks of his followers' welfare. The Gospel narrates that the disciples will eventually desert Jesus in the time of his passion, but he will not inflict on them any feeling of guilt. The person who has truly conquered the world is the one who is no longer locked up in oneself. Can we truly attend to the needs of others? Can we set aside our own biases against anybody for the sake of peace? How do we encourage other people?